not gonna get another one of those types of says. We ain't gonna get one of those says episode whatever we're on right now. Come on now. Listen up, guys. I got some crazy news. I already forgot what he sounds like. I just heard there's gonna be a new student in our class today. There is? I heard our teacher talking to the vice principal about it in the hallway. Okay, class. Take your seats, please. Ugh. I'm a little bit under the weather, so I can't do a female voice or anything lighter, so let's see what happens. I'll try. Miss Anderson, isn't there supposed to be a new student coming today? There is? I heard you talking to the vice principal. So you're eavesdropping? No, I mean, I heard you, but I wasn't trying to hear you probably. What does that, what, what does that supposed to mean? I want to surprise you, but since you already know, I may as well tell you. Just as Big Mouth here says, Oh, come on! What kind of teacher? Oh my god. You kids are getting a new classmate today. Cool! However, he seems to be a little late. What was that? A jet plane? What's that noise? What's going on? Save me, Amy! Sounds like it's coming from the sea. Are we gonna get a cutscene? Look, over there! It's coming right for us! It's gonna hit us! A fighter jet? Am I seeing things? Watch out! <laughs> the Catacombs Contest! Nice and big entrance for the first day of school. Nice and... Nice and entrance. What was that new kid's name again? Justin Kaido, right? There's something strange about him. I mean, he barely talks. I need to close the window. The teacher asked him to introduce himself, but he just said there's really nothing to talk about. I even tried talking to him and asking him if he plays LBX, but he just ignored me. He ignored you? Who does he think he is? I'd kill to have... Have you talked to me more? Uh, I mean, that's just rude. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Anyway, he doesn't seem interested in getting to know anyone, don't you think, Ben? Huh? Oh, yeah. Yeah, but this is the first day at our school. Some kids are just like that. By the way, after class, maybe we should head to... I know, Blue Cats, right? We need information about the catacombs contest. Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna... Should we talk to the new kid? Let's try it. Let's try it. Let's talk to him. Yeah, I need to warm up my freaking... Yo! Roll the intro! Shiraku 6 TV, on air! We are now live. Welcome back to another exciting episode of a Little Battle's Experience. In the previous episode, we just took on a big old boss battle. Nicknamed Insidious, whatever. Um, I haven't been uploading much lately. This could be up tomorrow, Wednesday, hopefully. If not, then Thursday. I haven't been uploading much because I've been focusing on the 700 subscriber special. And then I just got back from Twitch can TwitchCon. And oh my god, TwitchCon was amazing. If you've seen the blog, is it right here or no? Was it right here? But uh, like I said, TwitchCon was amazing. God damn. <clears throat> Why did I went back through here? Even if you had pressed B, it should have been right there. God, where's the Blue Cat's coffee shop? Oh, right there. A little lag may happen because all of a sudden I just noticed that my 3DS was down on the ground. And I blame my mom for 
bringing in her dog in and used the computer room so the dog might have played around and might have dropped the 3DS so because it was attached to the wire so so yeah a little more lag may occur again fuck my life <clears throat> The Catacombs Contest use unlimited regulations, which means it's an underground LBX tournament. They don't enforce any rules, meaning anything goes, and I mean anything. The participants are world class, and they have no mercy. It's do or die battle. This one could be pretty ugly. For sure, this upcoming competition is a little special. Why is that? You guys have heard of Artemis, haven't you? Of course! It's a tournament to find the best LBX player in the world. Every player on the planet dreams on competing in it. But what's Artemis got to do with the Catacombs Contest? This year's winner will get an entry pass to try for the Artemis World Title. Wait, which one? Which one in the beginning was, the Artemis or the Catacombs? I don't know, but as long as it's a tournament, I'm good. I don't care which one, as long as it's a tournament. Are you serious? Yeah, but that means your opponents are gonna be part particularly rough, tough, whatever. The New Dawn Risers challenge you to enter, so I think we can assume they plan to beat you and take the Platinum castle Capsule. This is a trap, dude. I bet they'd be using some pretty strong LBX. Bad. Do you still want to sign up? More than ever. I'll take every single one of them on if I have to. <clears throat> you understand that there's no guarantee they'll release your dad even if you do win. Still, I might be able to find some sort of lead or something. We're gonna join you for support. We can't let you go alone with... What with it? Being such a dangerous tournament and all that, I kind of messed up back there. You guys! Then we're all set. I'll take care of the registration for you. The Catacombs contest is in a week. Ah, oh, come on! In one week? Well then, we better get to Navarro's now and start training. There's just one more thing you kids do want to see. Where the big event is gonna happen, don't you? What? You have access? The Catacombs Contest is being held directly beneath your feet. What? You're joking, right? This place is pretty creepy. Guess it's perfect for an underground tournament like this. But wait, why is it under Land's coffee shop? You'll find out soon. Oh, come on! Open that door it's on the right. Well, all I can say is he's very suspicious enough with that coffee shop and the glasses and <gasps> Hurry up and start already! Crush him! Can't believe this is where they hold the catacombs in contest. You'd never know it was here. It's amazing. Justin. This is what you get for trying to take on three of us at the same time. They're finished! What?! Twenty-four point one seven seconds. Whoa, what a comeback! That dude's got mad skills! No, it wasn't a comeback. I think he set that all up himself. He was planning it. To take all three of them down at the same time! Uh-huh. You think? He predicted every move in that battle. Justin Kaido's an incredible LBX player. This is gonna be awesome! Oh god. <clears throat> Destroying three opponents at once would take some serious technique. There's no way I could do anything like that. You're a sniper. I 
could barely even tell what was happening. But I have to win this thing. I'm gonna save my dad. Ben. And you have a week? That's fine, I'll train you until then. You will? But this will be no ordinary train. I want you to equip your your AX00 cover pads and battle me. What? Are you crazy? There's no way we he can win with those flimsy cover pads. Well, if you can't even deal with that, you can't forget about winning the catacombs contest. I forgot his voice too. I'll do it. Let me know when you're ready. I need some maintenance first. So what exactly do I need to do? Two items, uh, maintenance. No, not buy. We got 10800 credits. She actually do maintenance or what? Oh, never mind. That's just the XP. So, what exactly did I need to do? So, they put on the cover pads. Roller. Brand, brand mail. Customize. So, we need to have. Something, something cover pads. I don't know what the hell is that. Is it on the chest? Should I attack me? Do I really have to do everything? Fuck. Why? That means I have to do adjust it again. Fuck my life. I guess we can go with it. I mean, it takes too much time, but still. Is this what you wanted? Or does he want Van to do this? What the hell? It's a waste of time. I'm not sure if he actually meant Van or myself as... Yeah, I'm just gonna switch to back. Oh my god. Man, so many whatever I got. If I had to switch back again to as Hunter and to AX blah blah blah, and he only wants Van, that's some bullshit right there. I clearly have no idea what I'm doing. Okay, change party. And he wants bad, so I guess. Okay, let's see. Whatever the cover pads are, I have no idea. Is this what you wanted, man? Not gladiator. Is this what you wanted? We're going to do some training. Ready? All right. Just using that guy, I guess. But why do I have to use AX Double Zero cover pads? Good question. It's to help you understand your opponent's damage type. If you don't take the time to think about it, your parts, you'll rely too much on one set and forgot about damage type. Damage types, huh? However strong your opponent might be, if you know what damage type they're weak to, you can still win. There are three different damage types. Cut, pierce, and smash. Guess we're a pierce? Your AX0 is weak against smash attacks. I think it'd be easiest to, to show you. Sure. Oh god! A gladiator with a mallet. Big ol' hammer. Oh god. Battle start. Bad, if you're if you're hit by an attack type you're weak to, it'll do more damage and the number will appear in red. You ready? Let's go. Okay. I better win this. What the hell? 
go. Okay. Was that what he meant? Ouch. Is it only just one on one? That's what I'm guessing. That was great. Till next time. Damn, so 85 HP left. Okay, let's see what was the real lesson about this. Okay, I bet you see how important damage types are now, right? Okay. Okay, time to enter the second stage of your train. Then take these. Bishop! Why? You'll find out soon enough, but now... Why do we need bishop parts? Okay, this part too, there's probably like, what, a, th a final third part? I guess we'll just have that episode like that. Okay, bishop, bishop, bishop. So many the goos. Bishop. Yo! Thank you. I got like so many bishop parts. I guess it's just depending on the quality as well. Cause I'm seeing 15 bishop and something other type of bishop, I don't know what. Let's go. <clears throat> Is this what you want? Bishops are strong against smash damage. I should be able to take what my glider can dish out. I see. So we're just gonna go through all three. Press X on the battle menu to see the damage types. Yours is on the left and your opponent's on the right. Cut, pierce, and smash. Okay, so... That's right, cut is any kind of slashing attack. Swords often have this type of damage. Pierce covers thrusting or stabbing attacks. That's why, that's why I think we're piercings. Smash, which covers crushing. If you choose wisely, it'll give you a huge advantage in battle. That's right, in this kind of situation, don't just ring, bang your head against the wall. Stay calm and customize your parts. It'll help. I know, there's so much to learn. My god. There are also elemental attributes to think about. Fire, water, electric. Once you've mastered the damage types, you should re read up on those. Oh my god. Got it. <clears throat> yep, let's go. Train with Cam using the bishop. So, using the X button, right? Okay, so my guard type. I'm good against smash, and I'm not good with pierce. Meanwhile, he's good against Pierce, but he's not good against Smash? What my, what's my type? What the heck? Oh! I guess. Let's go. This is all complicated. Battle start. I just love- Why can't we just change the music during off-screen? Here I come, man! In terms of weakness and resistance, Bishop is strong against Smash attacks. Let me show you in battle. Got it! I'm just gonna keep on smashing through, that's all. Yo! We still have a shield, so. Ouch! Shit, I miss. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, we're gonna get dash. We're gonna get that thing. That's for a point. Wait for it. Wait for it. What the hell? I can't! I can't! There was nowhere to avoid it! I could guard, but it's still gonna be damaged, though. Stop it. I've got this! I am not letting up. Too late! Never mind! There you go. There you go. I'm always ready for a we still got one more lesson. Hopefully one more, and then we're gonna end the episode there. Because this is what I'm getting. We're gonna get like three parts of this. 
Looking good, Van. Keep it up. Okay, next up is training based on the real thing. Alright. We can just equip whatever now. So let's switch back to Achilles. So like I said, there's like I think that this is the final part right here in the lesson, so. And whatever we're gonna do is just whatever's. Okay, where Achilles is on the top. Let's do it, let's do it, let's do this. One more, and we are set. Guess we're just gonna smash no matter what. <coughs> Train with can using any equipment. Now, use everything you learn in a real battle. Oh god! So press X. Guard type. Uh. I don't still understand, but we're just gonna go with it. Fuck it. You said we can use anything, so. I got nothing to judge. Battle start! Followed by, we got some heal pads, so there's no point. Shit. Oh damn! Oh god damn! God damn! Dodge it, dodge it, dodge it, dodge it! Oh what the boss! Oh god damn! No wonder I was so. It's, I get so heavily damaged against anyone with the axe no or. Now. Wow! Just barely. God damn. Onward and upward. Indeed. God damn. Nicely done. You're moving a lot better now. Let's leave it there for today. Go on and get some rest. We'll continue your training tomorrow. Well, you heard him, folks. We're gonna end this episode off like this. So, like, comment, subscribe. This is Shiraka's TV, and I'm signing out. <laughs>